Matthew Camp revealed that his Poughkeepsie house has been burned down on Instagram, read on to find out more about the arson attack and the house owner. Surveillance footage released by Matthew Camp shows an individual carrying two containers of gasoline onto the porch before covering the area in it, lighting it and running away. Sharing the news on Instagram, he captioned the images of the fire, January 14, 2021, an arsonist poured gasoline on the front porch of my home and set it on fire in an apparent hate crime, I was asleep inside, I am alive to face this person one day but everything I have ever owned is gone, share this story because queer people are still under attack all over the world, our voices will not be silenced. WHO is Matthew Camp. 36-year-old Matthew is a known figure in the adult film industry, and started his career in studio adult films in 2019, now, he's also a successful OnlyFans creator and is reported by the New York Times to make more than $10,000 a month at one point. He also starred on Slag Wars in 2020, a UK reality show hosted by Sophie Anderson and Rebecca Moore which seeks to find the next big LGBTQ plus icon. On Instagram, he has over 650,000 followers under the handle at Matthew Camp, and runs a clothing company named Daddy Couture, his Poughkeepsie, Halloween house. Matthew Camp purchased the Poughkeepsie house after a friend, the previous owner, passed away. I just bought this house in Poughkeepsie, it was my friend's house who passed away, he was a real close friend of mine. I bought this house and his stuff, he was an artist and his home was really an extension of his art, so I felt the need to preserve it and you know, live it, he told Pink News. The former owner of the house was Joe, Netherworld, Mandillo, who was a high-ranking member of the Church of Satan, many remaining members live in the local area and it's dubbed as the, Haunted Hudson Valley. Netherworld had reportedly built the house to be a showplace of his faith, and became a place for the church to come together and celebrate Halloween. Due to this, the Church of Satan reportedly feel it was an attack on them.